not like that. Not yet. See, because that's the problem with drinking. At first, there's no problem. You drink, or I drink, because there's this thing that happens with that first drink or two. It's like, it's like you feel powerful. Like, like you can do things and say things, things you never thought you could do or say, not in a million years. Like, you can tell off that girl you've always wanted to tell off, or talk to some guy you see from across the room. Some guy you don't even know, kind of like, but it's not like you know him. You don't even know him, but for a moment the world is just shinier and brighter and full of possibility. And it feels great. It feels so great until all of a sudden, it doesn't. Until all of a sudden, it all comes crashing down. What did they do to me? What did they do? What did they do to me? Chloe. Because I don't remember, and, and that's the truth. I, I don't remember. The last thing I remember is being alone outside with him, and, and he said, or maybe I said, I, I have something to tell you. Hey, man, we're about to head out of here. Oh, oh, oh shit. Am I, like, uh, interrupting something? Pause. And in the olden days, the story would end right about here. The drunk girl goes to a party and has one drink too many. And maybe when she's not looking, some guy slips something into her drink without her ever realizing. And whatever happens to her after that, well, we can speculate all we want, but we can't really know for Guys, they aren't talking. They're not saying a word. And the young woman, she can't remember. It's like after some point in the night, the lights went out. It's like all of a sudden, blackout. Person. 
you're actually like a good and decent person. And I know you know that this is fucked up. This is so fucked up. So whatever is going on, you better do something, Tanner. You better do something now. What do I do? I mean, what can I do? There's nothing that I can do. Pause. We need to go back. Rewind. We have to go back to the first tweet. The very first one. Like that. 
Seriously, but how do you get yourself into a situation like that? Like, what kind of girl does that? You think this can't happen to you? What happened to you would never happen to me. I am nothing like you. Yeah? You think so? Think again. This could happen to you. And you. And you. This could happen to all of you. And if you think it can't, you're just lying to yourself. Do you really think it was rape? Is, is that what you think? 
Nobody's calling it that. Nobody's using that word. <laughs> do I look like a rapist? You sure do. You know why? Because you are one. Fuck you. Forget it. And what does a rapist even look like, huh? Apparently, he looks like you. And you. Oh, and you too. What about him? He was there the entire time. I didn't see him do anything, and I didn't hear him say anything. Is he a rapist, or just a coward? It wasn't rape. It wasn't like that. Nobody's calling it that. I'm not calling it that. Because anybody who calls it that, they don't know what they're talking about. Anyone who thinks that's what happened, they don't have a clue. You think she wanted for this to happen? You actually think that? You don't know what happened. You saw some photos. You saw some video of some girl. And some other stuff too, and I admit it looks a little bad. Dude, I saw everything. Everybody saw everything. It's not what it looks like. It's not what it seems. Oh, so you're just saying that nothing happened then? I'm not saying anything until I lawyer up. <laughs> I mean, personally, I think she was just trying to have a good time, you know? I think she liked all the attention. She was passed out, you fucking tool. Okay, she wasn't passed out the whole time. Just, she was a little drunk, but just because you're drunk doesn't mean you don't want it. You're saying she wanted to be raped by a bunch of guys she didn't know? You don't know what you're talking about. You're jumping to a whole bunch of conclusions. Yes. Yeah. Meanwhile, there's a whole bunch of people that saw that girl come on to me at the party, saw her get into a car with me and a whole bunch of my friends. Nobody tugged her arm and nobody forced her to do anything. She was so drunk she could barely stand. You think she knew what was going on? Whatever! Everybody else did! Everybody knew what was going to happen! What? But she was going to be raped? By you? By you? By you? Everybody knew that? Not what you think. And who are you again? Oh, right. You're the star quarterback who fucked her while she was unconscious. So classy. So smooth. Way to go, Romeo. That's bullshit. You don't know what you're talking about. You're making up all these assumptions and you don't know shit. And who are you again? Oh, yeah. You're the moron with the, with the camera who decided to live tweet himself and his buddies raping some drunk girl. And they made a video and posted it on YouTube. Are you stupid or what? Like seriously, you must be the king of the dumbasses! Who does this bitch think she is? I'll tell you who I am, bitch. I'm the bitch who's gonna call the cops on you. I'm the bitch who saw what was happening that night because your moronic friend decided to lie tweet everything. I'm the bitch who's gonna blow the whistle on your sorry asses because I'll tell you what, I don't care if that girl was drunk and naked and walking down the middle of Main Street. That does not give you a free pass to rape her. It wasn't rape. Nobody raped anybody. You don't know what happened. None of you, none of you know what happened. It's not what it looks like. It's not what it seems. Yeah, you go with that when the cops question you. You see how far it gets you. Wait, no, please, you, you, you don't have to do this. No, why, why are you doing this? That is not the question you should be asking. The question you should be asking is why didn't you? Hello? 911? Yeah. 